I think the best roommate would probably <laughs> the best roommate would be Justin Watson. I think he he's very organized. Um, not worry about him, you know, like leaving messes or whatever. I feel like maybe like a CG type. I feel like he's a clean guy, nice guy, quiet guy. That might be the way to go. Best roommate. Well, for me, the best roommate is Donovan because I we have been roommates for some time now. So I think I know what I'm getting into. Just the type of vibe I like is probably like JPP. Um, I feel like would be a good fit of a roommate. Uh, best roommate is Zach because I've had him as a roommate before and he was awesome. Literally like could, didn't even realize he was there half the time. Man, best roommate can confirm Ryan Griffin. Great roommate, you know, kept it interesting. You know, we switch up the menu for dinner all the time. He took out the trash a lot. Uh, he let me sleep in his bed when he was gone on, <laughs> when he was on vacations, when I had a really bad bed, he let me use his bed, which is really nice. Well, he didn't really let me use it. I just used it. I'd probably say Tom, cause Tom gets all the perks and he's a quarterback. So you know, he's getting uh, some special treatment somewhere. If Jensen's uh, locker is any indicator, of how messy he would be, I would say Jensen would be the worst. Based clearly off Locker, it might be Ryan Jensen. I'd probably say Ryan. Ryan Jensen would probably be the worst roommate. Any offensive lineman would probably be the worst just because they're known to be uh, sloppy and messy and uh, have their ways of not being neat. The worst roommate would probably be Tanner Hudson, who it's funny because he's Justin Watson's actual roommate. And so hearing the stories about how bad of a roommate he kind of is in terms of like, not like his personality, but like, like he'll leave a mess or like, like if he spilled like some juice on the ground, like he wouldn't clean it up. He'll just kind of like dry it up. So now the floor is sticky. I'm like, that, that would drive me insane. I couldn't do that. Worst roommate was probably Justin Watson. I lived with him for like three weeks. I, you know, I was a really nice guy and let him sleep. Also without telling him on Ryan Griffin's bed um, when Ryan was out of town. And I made breakfast for him every single morning. And he, like really nothing in return. I think he might have given me a $25 gift card Chipotle after three weeks of free housing, free meals, and I got a $25 gift card at Chipotle.